Bees are one of the most hard-working creatures on the planet. These insects pollinate plants and produce honey, bee products are also used in medicine, cooking, cosmetology and other industries. In this part, we will learn a lot of interesting facts about bees, and see how unique those creatures are. Bees provide people with very valuable products, honey, wax, propolis, royal jelly, bee venom. People in Japan even eat bees themselves. These insects were highly revered in ancient Egypt, 5,000 years before Christ. Some researchers consider the Egyptians to be the first beekeepers. In Assyria, ancient Greece and Egypt, bee honey was used for embalming corpses. There is a historical fact about bees being used as weapons. Richard the Lionheart's soldiers threw vessels with swarms of bees into besieged fortresses. It is believed that the ancestors of bees were predatory wasps. Bees are very ancient creatures, a 100 million years old piece of amber with a frozen bee inside it was found in Myanmar. Found insect had characteristics of a wasp. There are more than 21,000 species of bees that can be found all over the world, except cold continents such as Antarctica. The Apis mellifera scutellata, are the most dangerous bees on the planet, descended from the African subspecies. This bee don't just attack when provoked, but also stubbornly pursue the offender. The size of an ordinary bee is about 15 millimeters, however, the dwarf bee Perdita minima grows only up to 2 millimeters. The largest bees are species called Megachili Pluto and Thophila. Their size is 4 cm, and they have a wingspan of about 6 cm. The bee belongs to the category of arthropods. Her body consists of three main parts, head, thoracic part and abdomen. The body of the bee is covered by hair. They protect the insect from the dirt, and it also used for obtaining sensitivity. The hair of a bee is a natural sensory organ. A favorite nutrition of bees is nectar, pollen and ready, made honey. The bee can easily find the nectar source by its smell. When a source of nectar is found, the bee begins to perform a special dance to attract the attention of fellow bees. The nectar can be sucked only with the help of a proboscis, which is perfectly adapted with these purposes in bees. The bee's sense of smell is concentrated mainly on the antennae. With its well-developed sense of smell, furry workers detect explosives better than dogs. Bees can steal food supplies from other hives, a stranger is easily identified by smell. Bees have many enemies. Among them there are parasites, wax moths, ticks, and predators, for example, wasps, hornets, mice and toads. The birds hunt for bees especially, titmice and shrikes. Bees have five eyes, two large compound eyes, and three ocelli. The compound eyes are situated on either side of the bee's head. The compound eyes are composed of thousands of little lenses or facets. Together, the facets help bees see color, movement, and patterns. The function of the three ocelli at the top of a bee's head is less understood. These eyes are arranged in a triangular pattern and each contains only one lens. Ocelli, sometimes called simple eyes, aid in the detection of sunlight, or light intensity in general. Bees can distinguish the polarizations of light. They use this ability to orient themselves in those cases when the sun is covered with clouds. Polarized light is often found in nature, and it is given to insects to an ability see something in the surrounding world that is completely inaccessible to the human eye. Bees have well-developed color vision. They distinguish the following colors, blue, yellow, orange, green, white, but do not distinguish red. A bee can fly at a speed of 60 km per hour while making about 400 wing flaps per second. It is believed that such rapid flapping of wings creates wind vibrations, which people hear as buzzing. Bees use their sting as a defense tool. However, an insect can die if it stings a person. The fact is that the sting of a bee is not only pointed, 
it has very small spikes that can only be seen through a microscope. For example, if a bee stings an insect, then it easily pulls the sting out of the chitin, staying alive. However, when a bee stings a person, its sting gets stuck firmly into elastic skin and sticks out with part of the bee's abdomen when the bee tries to fly away. Having suffered such a serious injury, the insect dies within seconds. For a person of average weight the lethal dose of bee venom is 0.2 grams. This corresponds to about 250 to 500 bee stings. However, a person with an allergy to bee venom can die from a single bite. Honeycombs are truly a miracle of nature. These are bee wax structures that consist of ordered hexagonal cells. The honeycomb serves as a container for eggs, larvae and food supplies, as well as a residence for adult insects. Depending on season, the number of bees in the hive ranges from 20 to 80,000. Very strong bee colonies during the main honey harvest can appear because of 100,000 bees. In winter, bees do not sleep, but they gather in a tight ball and in such way warm each other. The bee family consists of drones, worker bees, and one queen. The listed individuals of the bee family have their own structural features. They have a different shape of the head, the structure of the eyes, and some parts of the body. Each individual has its own status and performs a specific role. The central figure of the bee family is the queen, she is responsible for the duration of the genus. The weight of the queen ranges from 150 to 300 milligrams. The queen bee can lay about 2,000 eggs per day. Male bees are called drones. They are 20 to 30 percent larger than a worker bee and do not have a sting, so they can be safely picked up. Queens and drones have no wax glands, so they cannot secrete wax. The main purpose of drones is the insemination of the queen, mating takes place in flight. A swarm of drones flies out of the hive after the female, and she allows several of them mate. During the copulation, the male loses the genital organ along with part of his own abdomen and dies. The fate of those drones that did not manage to participate in mating is also unenviable, with the approach of autumn, most colonies of bees expel the drones and they die. Such behavioral features result from drones eating more food than working individuals, in order to feed them. Worker bees make up the vast majority in the bee colony. These are female individuals with underdeveloped genitals. In the bee colony, they are the smallest, their length is only 13 millimeters, and their weight is 100 milligrams. In summer, the worker bee lives for about 30 to 40 days, while the average life expectancy of a queen bee is up to five years. Worker bees perform various and complex functions of the care for offspring, collecting and processing nectar and pollen. In addition, worker bees secrete wax and build honeycombs. Protect the nest from enemies, manage the processes of family life, regulate the microclimate in the nest, carry water to the hive, expel drones, clean the nest, seal the cracks in the hive with propolis. During the day, the bee can make 10 flights and fly around about 7,000 flowers. Each time the insect finds its way home. During a long flight, the bee may eat some of the collected nectar. In order to collect nectar to produce 1 kilogram of honey, bees visit about 10 million flowers. They sometimes take a break for a nap and rest, holding each other's paws, so as not to fall out of the flower. Throughout the entire honey season, experienced beekeepers collect about 70 kilograms of honey from the hive. The maximum record for honey collection was 420 kilograms. They are amazing and useful insects that live next to us. They are perfectly organized and also produce amazingly tasty and healthy products. That's all from me, if you enjoyed it, please like this video and subscribe to the channel, see you again.